Hi, YouTubers, wet shavers, and exercise lovers everywhere. It's Mark with GeorgeStune.com. I'm back with another video. Well, in a previous video, I was having an evening shave, and I remarked that I really like to have that workout, a hot shower, and then to have a nice shave, and then go out for the evening to uh, meet family and friends. And uh, it's just a great feeling. Uh, but that workout is really great to have in the evening before you have that shower and shave. It really is, it really is a terrific feeling. And uh, I said I was going to do a video about what I use uh, as part of my exercise routine. And I have it right here. And I've had it ever since I was in junior high school. And uh, there is a bit of a background story to this. So I wanted to share that with you and then show you exactly what I use as part of my exercise routine. Now, I've used this device on and off over the years ever since I was in junior high. Now, my junior high school was uh, Greenview Junior High, and it was 7th, 8th, and 9th grade. So where are you? You're 13, 14, 15 years old, right, during those years. And probably about 8th grade, hormones start kicking in, and all the young men start to develop, and they're packing on muscle. And I was the stereotypical 98-pound weakling. I was real thin. I was a skinny, skinny kid. I'll tell you how skinny I was. Many years later, I asked my mother, I said, Mom, when you were looking at me, what did you worry about? And she said, when is this kid going to get shoulders? <laughs> That's how thin I was. Uh, my mom never thought that I would pack on any muscle. And uh, I was very, very thin. Well, about eighth grade, I think it was, I want to do something about it. Now, there was no weightlifting room in, in the junior high school. There was somewhat of a weight room at the high school, but that was really reserved for football players on the football team. And if you're 14 years old, you're not gonna be able to go up to the high school and start lifting weights with 17 and 18 year old uh, young men. It's not gonna happen. So I was looking for a solution. I really wanted to, to get muscular, to get big. And I was doing some research. I can't remember where I saw it. Might have been in the back of a sportings magazine or a comic book magazine. I don't know where I saw it but I found this device and it wasn't available in sporting goods stores or department stores. And the only place I found it was in the Sears catalog. Now back then the Sears catalog was sort of like the amazon.com of the day without the internet. You could go to the Sears catalog and look through all those pages and chances are if you wanted something exotic like what I wanted, you would be able to find it. And sure enough, I found it there it was $50 back then, that was a lot of money. But I went to the Sears catalog department, it was an actual department in the department store, and they had a counter there and they had a catalog there, so you could copy the number and hand it to the, the clerk and pay for it, and two weeks later, you would go back and pick up your package. And that's what I did, so I ordered this thing, and two weeks later, this is what I got right here. I got the Bullworker 2. That's right, the Bull Worker 2. This is an isometric exercise bar, if you will. Let me show it to you. This is the original case it came in, and this is the original piece of equipment I've had all these years, and I've used it and trained with it on and off all these decades. And this is what it is. It's an isometric exercise bar. It has steel cables, which are coated with plastic, and it has a large spring inside. So the idea here is that you compress this. You, you, you compress it and then you hold it for seven to 10 seconds and while you're breathing and uh, you do a variety of exercises like that. Or you pull the cables like this and you hold that for seven to 10 seconds. And this is what I used. And uh, did it work? Well, yeah, it really did work. I remember after having it for about a month, month and a half, I was walking to the cafeteria and there was a football coach coming up from behind me. And he must have seen me and he came up behind and he kind of grabbed me by my laps, you know, right here and then on my shoulders. And he said, wow, hey, you're getting kind of big there. What, what have you been doing? And I just kind of shrugged and smiled and said, well, you know, exercising a little bit. And I didn't tell anyone what I, I didn't tell anybody what I, what I was using. Okay, fast forward. I get a call from my older brother Tom and he's looking at a piece of exercise equipment on Amazon and he wanted my opinion of it. 
And he said, hey, it kind of reminds me of your bulwarker. And I said, hey, you know what, Tom? I still have my bulwarker. And he said, well, <laughs> why am I not surprised? Yeah, I have a reputation in the family of hanging on to things forever. And uh, he said, why am I not surprised? I said, well, yeah, you know, this was, this was six months ago that he contacted me. We were talking and um, I decided, you know what, I'm gonna change up my exercise routine. I had uh, lifted weights, I have done body weight exercises. In high school, I was on the gymnastics team and I was a lousy gymnast, but I joined the team in order to learn how to train my body using my own body weight. So that involved a lot of pull-ups, a lot of push-ups, handstand push-ups, that sort of thing. And that's what I've been doing on and off here with other forms of exercise like jumping rope, that sort of thing. You know, pull-ups, push-ups, planks, that sort of thing. And I thought, hey, you know what? I'm gonna use this again. So six months ago, I, I pulled this out and I started using it again. Now it's got a lot of miles on it. And um, you know, it's probably seen better days, but it was very, very robustly built and it still works. But I thought, you know what? It would be neat if I could get a new one. So I went up to Amazon and sure enough, they make a brand new bulwarker. And here it is right here. This is the Bullworker 36 inch Bow Classic right there. It comes in this beautiful, beautiful canvas case. It's got some beautiful embossing here or stitch work, if you will, uh, of the, the name and that sort of thing. It really is very, very well made. And they have improved the design. All right, so here it is. This is the this is the Bullworker Bow Classic, 36 inches, and you can see it still has the same kind of steel cable here. The handles are larger, the grips are larger. It has the similar kind of power meter here with this ring that slides up and down. The uh, the numbers to measure your progress are etched right on the barrel, whereas this one. They give you this little plastic guard here, so to speak, and then this slide, this would slide up. A little cheap, a little more cheaply made, but this one is really very nice. And the other big improvement is, is that it has handles. So now you can really, really grasp hold of this and really, really give it a, a good pull and really hang on to it, hang on to it really, really well. And you can do a variety of exercises with this. You can do that kind of thing. You can. You can do a, like a curl like this. And uh, again, chest compression like this. Now the spring I have in here is the heavy duty spring. It comes with three springs. This is the heavy duty spring that I have, but it also comes with two additional springs, a, uh, a medium spring and a beginner spring. So if you, if you can compress this, there's a spring here that will work for you. And uh, that's a really nice feature of it also. And it has this little pouch here right on the case where you can store those springs. Also comes with a workout manual showing you all the various exercises that you can do. And it gives you routines, it gives you a whole exercise regimen. Now it works with uh, isometric movement uh, and a variety of other movements you can do. In other words, you can do a repetition with this. You could say do, uh, you could take this and do uh, 10 repetitions like this and then on the 10th one, hold it for 10 seconds. You can do those kinds of exercises and I have done that with this. But really, mostly I do isometric. That's what I did when I, when I was a kid, when I had it in junior high school and I saw great results with it. So I decided, you know what? This one has probably seen better days. You know what, just set it aside and invest in something new. I paid $130 for this, $129.99 six months ago. It's now $149.99 uh, on the day that I'm making this video. So $150 after all those decades, uh, just adding on another 100 bucks to the 50, which is what I believe I paid for this. Not bad at all, and considering this has lasted me from junior high school, this thing is really, really old. Um, you know, this is going to last you uh, as long, if not longer. 
and of course you have the two springs and two additional springs with it that will help you get up and running. But I like it a lot and it's really gives me a good full body workout. I train four days a week with this and my workouts last about 15 to 18 minutes, something like that. And I don't do all of the uh, lower body exercises, but I do all of the upper body exercises. And I'm probably gonna modify that so that my workouts get to be about 20 minutes. And that was the reason why I came back to this, because of my schedule, in that I can get a great workout in in a short amount of time. I don't have to devote a lot of time to it, and I feel great. Uh, I feel that I am making progress with it and that I am getting some benefit and um, I think it was for the money I think it was a very very good investment just like this one was a great investment Now, over the years I use this uh, along with my gymnastics training along with my weight training along with uh, other kinds of training that I did whether for, for endurance skipping rope that sort of thing uh, I would use this and I would set it aside and I would kind of focus on some other kind of training and then inevitably I would come back to this, which I, which I did again six months ago. And um, I'm just so happy that they are continuing to make these and that they've improved on it. They also make a smaller one, which is the 20 inch steel bow. That one has two handles and it allows you to, I guess, focus and concentrate more on your chest your, uh, your arms, your shoulders, that sort of thing. But that's a, a very nice one too. And uh, I, I, might, I might get one of those as well down the road here. But um, yeah, the Bull Worker. The Bull Worker Bow Classic 36 inch isometric uh, trainer. It's really, really a terrific, terrific device. I've used it ever since I was 14 years old and it really has made a difference for me. And I uh, just wanted to share that with you. That's what I use to train with, and it does give me a good workout. All right, hey, that's it. That's all I wanted to mention to you. Thanks very, very much for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. Please share, please subscribe. Hit that bell so it'll give you a yell the next time I upload a video. Comment below, let me know what are you using to train and to work out with. Uh, check out my blog, georgetune.com slash blog for my comic strip George, other cartoons, other videos like this. Check out my Amazon page. All the items that I review on this channel can be found on my Amazon page, nicely organized and categorized. You can find that page at amazon.com slash shop slash Mark Zerady. Thanks again very much. I'll see you again real soon.